Hello and thanks for watching Gary Teachers Maths. I'm going through the NXL higher tier paper from 2019. This is paper one and um, it's question one. So it's a question about probability and we've got a probability table here. We're told there are only blue cubes, red cubes and yellow cubes in a box. And we've got a table for the probability of taking a random cube out from the box. And what we've got to try and do is complete this table. So we're told that the number of red cubes in the box is the same as the number of yellow cubes that's in the box. What that means is the probability of getting a red is going to be equal to the probability of getting a yellow. So I'm going to call that X and X and fill it into that table like that. And uh, the thing we need to know is that the total probability should add up to 1. So we can say that 0 0.2 plus, and I'm going to add them up, 2x should equal 1. So we've got a little equation here, which now is going to let us work out what x is. So we can say, take away 0 0.2 from both sides, and we get that 2x equals 0.8 and then if we divide through by 2 we end up with x equals 0.4 that's dividing both sides of it by 4 so to complete the probability table there we need to write in 0.4 and 0.4 so we're told that there are 12 blue cubes in the box and we're being asked to work out the total number of cubes that are in the box. So what we can see is, well, if the probability of getting a blue is equal to 0.2, then we can see that the probability of getting a red or a yellow is actually twice that. So that means there must be twice as many red and yellow cubes as there are blue ones. So if we've got 12 blue cubes in the box, we can see that there must be, must actually be 24 red and 24 yellow. And that's because the probability of getting a red is twice that of getting a blue. So to get the total number of cubes that are in the box, all we need to do is add those up, 12 plus 24 plus 24. So that will be 60. And that's it. The total number of cubes in the box is 60. And we've done it. I hope that's been helpful to you. If it has, please like our video and subscribe to our channel, which is Gary Teaches Maths. And for more help, check out our website, which is bestmathstutors.co.uk. Thanks for watching.